All right, folks, we are back with 30 Minute Valheim. This is Cody. Welcome back. I haven't moved this dude since the last video. He's just been standing here wondering what the heck's going on. Really want some raspberries. Only have mushrooms and grilled necktail. And uh, got one boar in the, in the hole here. And I'm not going to start getting him trained just yet because I need to be there for that to happen. I'm just going to leave him there. And uh, my hope is, honestly, that I find a second one, get two in there at once, because then we get a better deal. Because uh, the whole point is to have two at least, start breeding them. Just kind of have a captive place for these. And of course, I really want to find that two star, that one star, and get those in there. Nope, there's a couple of rocks there, and I definitely want to grab those. I want to make a hoe because like I said one of the things I like to do is have paths to the things I find like mushrooms and berries so I can continuously find them and not kind of have to have too much on my map yeah, there he is I got him he's just doing fine he's happy nothing wrong with living in that thing he thinks all right I'm gonna go make that hoe Alright, now I got a hoe, so wherever I go, I can make myself some padding. And uh, once I get one more boar in there, start training them, I'm good to go. But I also would love to get some boar meat or some deer meat, so let's see what we can find. So yeah, basically, as I go through here in the brand new world, what is he trying to tell me? Yeah, I know I crafted a hoe. Mm-hmm, thank you. I just like to proceed a little bit at a time, opening up a circular pattern around where I live. Look at that. See, here we got some berries. That's exactly what I wanted, just to kind of have a little extra stamina booth boost right up front. And then yes, so this is what I think is useful to do. I'm just gonna level the ground. Look at this. So next time I come around here, these will be super obvious that they're here. And uh, another thing is to just make a path now, just basically back to my base, which is just exactly this way. And of course, along the way, I might see other things and path over to them and kind of want to get angles where I can see them. Look at that. I got rocks here. So to have it clear, I want to kind of follow the grass. I'm on a pretty big incline here, which is fun. And this just is obviously a nice like just little extra not really buying me too much but it, it makes it easy for me to understand where my <laughs> where my stuff was all right i want to get that boar excited just over here trying to make a path so yeah it's a little bit harder to tell that i made a path through here but once you get it once i understand it i'll know it's there yes so now it'll be pretty easy to just run over here and grab raspberries whenever I want and they're not even not just a good snack up front but they're also useful later in the game and I see some mushrooms so we're just gonna build a path over to those see now I'll have a path that I can just go grab my mushrooms grab my berries because they do regenerate it just takes a little time all right so there's those and those. Not a bad start. Found a little food source. Okay. <clears throat> there we go. Here's another boar. Come on, buddy. That was a whole mess of boar, but for now I'm just gonna grab this one. And guess what? We can follow my path. Hey, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh boy. Oh no. 
You know, when he bites, they kind of turn away, so I gotta make sure it doesn't get lost. Hello. And this is the interesting part, because I kind of want to get him in there without losing the other one. Oh, I'm not rested. Whoa, how about that? Yeah, here we go. Yep, here we go. Yeah, I know. It's a little difficult. See, they're kind of... Okay, there we go. Hey, come on in. Come on in. Oh, don't want you out. Now, I should have maybe built the double door, but I haven't done that yet. Right, there we go, there we go, there we go. Come on, come on, come on. Ah. Uh, oh, come on, come on. Ah. Uh. There we go, there we go, 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 go in. Go in, go, go, go in. Yes, look at that. All right. So I'm going to throw these mushrooms in here. We're big fans of those. And we're going to go over here and just kind of rest and... Uh, Kind of let those dudes calm down and kind of start eating their mushrooms. So, I'm going to be pissed off for a little bit, but they should calm down not too long from now. I hope they don't tear up the fence while they're at it. Let's see how long it takes them to calm down. For comfort, the bed must be you know, helping out. can't see me, so they should stop being excited soon. There they go. And you'll see, there they go. See, now they're getting tame. They're eating, they're happy, someone's taking care of them. And that's kind of what it takes to start taming a boar, in case you haven't gotten that part figured out yet. So we're six minutes in to the second session. 36 minutes into the game, 37 minutes into the game. We got two boars getting trained. That's a pretty good amount of ammo here. A nice fire. We know where the berries and the mushrooms are. And, uh, you know, my next move here is to go back to those, that group of boar I just saw and kind of. Oh, here we go. Here's a couple. Okay, that's just a one, so we're good. So nothing special there. Kill this dude. So now I'm just gonna like, any boar I see, I'm just gonna take him out, unless it's a one star or a two star, and then I'm gonna take those over and train them. Because they'll, of course, return a lot more as they go. Great. So look at that, we got all sorts of new crafting options coming up. We're close enough to the base that those two boar are gonna continue getting to know one another and become my buddy. Alright, so this is also just a basic boar, not a one or two star. Now if we see a one or two star, it might be dangerous, but I will do my best to bring him home. Alright, good. So, great. Like I say, I want to kind of stay close, but extend my circle a bit. Not too big deal if I go away, but it might waste some of the food on the training. As long as I stay kind of a zone, the zones are sort of... There's a mod if you ever want to understand how the zones work that'll show you exactly where they are. Well, I'm not sneaking, so that guy's going. I don't have a lot of stamina, so I'm going to waste my time chasing it. Well, this is a big hill already right here. This is okay. Kind of steep, right by my base. More raspberries, baby. So you know what that means? Gonna pathen over here. Don't need to really level the land here. It's really kind of more of a mushroom thing. And it's so close, you might think, ah, oh, you don't really need to do it. But honestly, I, I'm telling you, it's a time saver. And uh, it just kind of part of the game for me. It, be nice if this was one of the automated things, honestly. To just pathen as you walk through places, but I don't mind having to take a little extra effort here. <clears throat> All right, two minutes in here. There's a deer. 
I'm going to go ahead and try to sneak this guy. thing about sneak is you want to make sure you don't use up all your stamina before you stop to recover. Because otherwise you'll stand up and they'll know you're there. He's walking away, which is annoying. There he goes. Okay. Oh, there's two. Alright. I well, might be able to get both. Okay. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Look at this. Okay. 17. Resting a little bit more. Completely unaware that I'm here. And... Hey! Oh! I forget how weak I am. <laughs> Expecting to one shot. That's not how it went. Alright, let's just get back to this and we'll see what we find next time. Alright. I actually think maybe the flint axe is a better choice right now, but... Okay, so... The path, if I continue going this way, I'm going to run into the boss stone area. So I'm going to kind of wind instead around this incline. Stop catching my breath. There you go. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Plenty of gray dwarf eyes. Yeah, I know. I see ya. Oh, look at that. See? Now my path has multiple berries along it. I'm gonna go... I need to find a few more mushrooms. That's what I'd love to find. Gonna make this boar meat that I've got. There we go. These guys are still taming up. I don't want to frighten them, so I'm kind of gonna swing out here just a little bit. There we go. I love this. Love this trail. Love the just initial starting point of this whole thing. All right, let's make a couple pieces of boar meat. Cook that up. Now, I got some leather scraps, but <laughs> only two. I think I'm going to need a few more before I can do anything useful. I'll go check that in a second. I definitely want to eat as much as I can. There we go. Perfect. Got it. Okay. So a little more stamina and a bit more health. That's great. Let's see. So. Oh. I'd love to make the knife and the bow. Yeah, we got leather scraps. We could make a flint knife. Those are pretty good. Okay, so yeah, one of the big things I want to do now is get as many leather scraps as I can. It's night time, so I'm going to go ahead and take a nap. Enemies. Okay, there we go. Good night, everyone. Phew. All my sleep, I was in fits and fretful dreams with the weight of a nightmare heavy on my chest. When morning came, I greeted it with relief. <laughs> of course I did. Okay, I'm just going to check on these boar real quick. 19%, they're hungry. They still have two mushrooms. Sorry for pissing you guys off, just wanted to check on you. Okay, so let's see. There's one. Let's go ahead and take him out. Kind of hurt. Okay. Yeah, I guess. Let's see. Let's try this time to sneak up and use the axe. Who sees me? I don't know. Oh, <laughs> that deer. Hey. 
shit. <laughs> Damn it. All right. More berries. I'm certainly finding plenty of berries. Okay, I think I have a trail right here. Wait, here? There. Okay, great. Um, so that's where I came. Okay, just trying to get myself oriented. So I think my other trail is over here. Yes. There. Okay, so then there's another little branch here. And I'm just going to connect it over here. There we go. Okay. I don't really think I need many rocks. What I need is some flint to make that knife. And various other things. Bow and arrow. Well, the arrows at least. So once I get the bow, I'll be able to make the arrows. Seventeen, yeah. Okay, some more flint over here. I don't want to go too far because I'm trying to train my boar. Let me get that bow and arrow and shoot them birds and get those feathers. Oh, here we go. Yes. Okay, get more leather. Gonna be making cool stuff with all sorts of leather. Oh, mushroom! Yay! Okay. Okay. Mushroom is 15 stamina. Berries are 20. So I'm definitely going to stick with berries for the stamina for now. Okay. And, yeah. Can you this concept. And, uh, yeah, the trails later, they're just fun. Little, re like, reminders, like where you've been, what's been up. It just kind of makes it feel a little more like your place, you know? Okay, at some point I am going to actually try to stalk some deer. But for now, I'm going to see, get some more flint. I'm still messing with my controls. This river. And, uh, sea is calling to me, folks, but it's gonna be a little while. I'm gonna get those boar trained. I'm gonna get my gear up. I'm gonna explore probably most of this island before I do any sort of sailing. Look at that. Berries galore, y'all. I wish I could find as many mushrooms right now as I found berries. Alright. Yet another trail. Nineteen minutes in. We're making slow progress, you know. About to make a knife. We've got a hoe and a knife today. <laughs> I think that's the order. little breather here. Alright, get back to it. No rest for the Viking. Cannot wait to harvest that fine wood, but we'll need sharper axes for that. These little birds are still getting tame. Not there yet. Alright, 
I've got enough for the knife. I'm gonna go make that sucker. It's my favorite weapon before the sword. I mean, axe is fun, but knife is sneaky. effective on those deer, but not certain on that. Yes. There we go. Alright, that knife is great. Next thing I want is a bow. That knife is pretty good. Okay, I think those guys still have food, right? <laughs> if I can get out my door. Yeah, I mean, they're still enjoying themselves. They're going to need more food. I'm going to give them raspberries this time because I've got more of those than I have mushrooms. I'm gonna piss them off, but kinda can't help that. Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Better repair this fence. They are eating away at it. Angry little Munchkins. They didn't really do much damage, but you know. Don't want them getting out. Okay. Cool. Cool, cool. Alright, so those guys got more food. I'm gonna make myself a little bit more food. They'll calm down. 22 minutes into the second session here. I've got a knife. I'm pretty happy about that. Club. My basic axe. Haven't really started organizing things yet. That's kind of coming up. Okay, they've chilled out again. Almost chilled out again, I guess. Okay. And yeah, let's take a look here. What do we got going on? All right, so I got a rock. Well, rocks I don't want to carry. I got these I don't want to carry. So I'm going to go ahead and make another bucket. It won't be long before I'm going to be getting into some of storage logistics. But for now, I'm still keeping things super, super simple. No base building yet. Just keeping these things in there. So I don't count on this being my permanent base at all. So uh, we're just going to do a little bit sloppy for now. Mostly I'm just going to make sure I don't have too much weight on me. And that uh, I'm not doing things redundantly. So I guess at the very minimum I'll do some organization. So this trophy I won't care about for a while. The flint head arrows I won't care about for a while. The flint is a thing I'll use. Uh, big stones I'll keep there. Feathers I'll use. Uh, trying to get some semblance of reason here. Now these are all kind of these kind of materials and the trophy. Interesting. So I think the things I'll use soon, I'll put in this bucket. And the things I probably won't use for a little while, I'll put here. Got it. Later it'll be like food and this bucket and yada yada yada. Um, but for now, I'm just going to kind of do it like that. Okay. Really itching for a, some deer meat, y'all, and some deer leather. Uh, I mean, mostly what I need is going to be farmed from boars at this point, but... Really want to get a deer. All right, here's my opportunity. Okay. Just gonna sneak up on him, right? 
right here. A little hungry, but that's okay. I think I can do it. Yeah, I hear you, buddy. Hey, yeah! Look at that. That's what I'm looking for. Okay. So, yeah. There'll be some things I can make with deer stuff later, of course. The deer hide. Just wanted to prove to myself I could take at least one deer out. And boy, did I ever. I did it. Alright, so a little bit more of the map to reveal over here. We've got about five minutes left in this 30 minute set. And I found another structure. Let's go check that out. Uh, what's usually going on with these is a little chest up there. Amber? I still haven't figured out why we get Amber. Can anyone tell me? Thank you. Because I yet have found anything I can do with Amber other than keep it in boxes and wonder why I've got so much Amber. They're really great, I guess, for putting in obliterators. Definitely want to keep checking every structure, because what I'm going to find eventually is a bee, which is going to give me honey, which is going to be awesome. Oh, this is just empty. Nothing going on there. All right, four minutes left. And of course, there may be people who play Valheim faster than I do. I'm not worried about that. Just do it. My basic build and churn. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna chase this guy. See if I can find him. Ah, oh, here we go. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Yes, baby. And uh, yeah, let's go check out the ocean a little bit more. Ooh, I'm hungry. Great. Let's eat uh, more stamina. More berries over here. And a hut. All right, you know the drill. Now there's a certain point, of course, when I start getting a little further out that I won't do this, but I think this is about the perimeter, what I want to do. Now to some extent, it also helps to put fences around these, but for now, I'm just gonna do the trails. And I'm gonna take this one over here along the coast Coastal trail's great, because if I ever find like a black forest or something on the edge, then I'll be wanting to take my cart over there. And the closer to the coast, the less inclined I have to worry about on the way. Check this out. Nothing. Okay. All right, worth checking out to see if there's a bucket, see if there's a bee. I'm gonna go this way, cause I don't, I got a little water here. Twenty-eight forty-four. So I'm going to be closing this up in a moment. I'm gonna just stop right in the middle of pathing. I'll be picking right back up here on the path. So be sure and check out as we continue on this adventure. Uh, though right now I'm not too far, I think, from the last place I extended a path. Looks like there it is. Coming up. My place. All right. There it is. There's that path there. So now I've got a path that will take me all the way down the coast, back to my base if I want. I got a lot of paths to raspberries. Let's get these boars. Let's go just check them out real quick. Piss them off right before we end here. 30 seconds to go. Let's just see where they're at. 49% y'all. So about an hour into the game, I got boars about halfway trained. I got my buckets with stuff in them. Some stuff I'll use sooner than other stuff. Trophy over here, don't really need that. Amber. Don't think I ever need that. And uh, well, that's it for now. See you later.